Hey, what's going on, guys? My name is Squid King, and today I'm going to be playing, I think, more Astroneer. I'm not sure if I made a video on it in the past or whatnot, but uh, I've definitely played the game before. Uh, it's been a, a few months, you know. I haven't played in a while, but uh, as soon as I landed, uh, I noticed some th uh, some things were different. Uh, as soon as I landed, my capsule popped open, and this thing sprouted up. And I went over here to this pad, and I uh, I well, I went on it. No, not that. And I went on it, and it, it popped up with some cargo drop. And I initialized that, and it came down, and it popped up with two little, like, crate things. One of them popped open into this thing, and then I had to connect the cable to it. And then the other one was a thing I placed on top, and it's a mat, it's a fabricator. And, you know, you use it, and I can build a large platform or a research chamber. But in order to do that, I need resin and compound, which those have been in the game forever. So I know, I know where to find those, but... It says here I can reinitialize cargo drop. Oh. Oh, that gets rid of it. Oh. And whatever, I can just make it again. Okay, so now I have my my thing. And yep, I can do that. I can I can't flatten terrain. I can't raise it either. I can only dig it, okay. So what I need to do is that's oxygen right there. I need to go out and find resin and compound so I can start building stuff. Oh, right here. Compound. Didn't even take like five steps away. It's right here. Compound is the uh, the most common, uh, commonly found thing in the world. Aside from, of course, organic matter, which is just all these plants and stuff you see around. But compound is the most commonly used building material, and it's the most commonly found in that you know, field, I guess, district, whatever. And so from that one little hole, I got four stacks of compound, and I, so that means that whatever I want to build over here, so like if I want to build another platform to put stuff on, I need resin, but I want to build this research chamber, so I press that, and it initializes the building, and then this is all new, I have never seen this before. So it's like, goes along and like, puts the, and like you can see the compound disappearing, like it's being used to build it. And that's really cool, I've never, I've never seen this before, this is all new. There's been a lot of updates since I last played, so I, I have no idea. But this is, this is looking really cool. And I imagine it'll all pop into like color and stuff once it's done. Alright, so it, it finished, and it just made a thing. Maybe I need to place it on top of a thing, like can I unpack it? Now it's a module, so I need to place it on top of something like this, so I need to build another... I need to find resin, because with that, I build another large platform, and then I could place the thing on that. So I need to go around and find resin, and it's right over there, I can see. Resin is um, also a very common material. Usu compound and resin are usually spawned right next to the beginning area, because you need it to sort of kick things off. So it's always really commonly found everywhere. And then, large platform build it. And then that'll build it with the resin. Hang on, if I get in the way... Oh, it stops, it stops building. Alright, so I, I... The large platform has finished uh, building. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take that, I'm going to orient it like... I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to actually face it like that. So that then when it unpacks... This one's bigger than the last one. The cable is right there, and I can just plug it in like that. So now, the module goes right on top like that, just like that. Alright, and now, with the researcher, you can find things, uh, you can find like these items, uh, all around, all around the world, excuse me, and they, you put them on this, and it does like a little, does a little spinny thing, and usually that gives you points and stuff, so like it like goes and it gives you bites and then bites are used in this which this is like a researcher thing so you can use it to like unlock new things like that's like that sort of stuff but first off what I want to craft is tethers so tethers cost compound and also energy as you can see here energy can be found in multiple forms you can make it which actually I'm gonna think I can do that first oh no I, I need to research solar panels and then those will help, but I can make small generators, but I don't really need power at the moment. So, what what those tethers did, 
I think I crafted the tethers, but I don't know what I want. Um, yeah, didn't I craft tethers? Pretty sure I crafted them. Yeah, there, there are the tethers. So, I think if I press T, yeah, now this tether will, um, it'll bring oxygen around. So, you guys know how if I go away, it breaks the tether, and I start to lose oxygen. But these, I can, like, move them out, and then I can just keep placing them. I can just keep placing them. And then I can move them a little bit. So basically, I can use these to maintain, to keep oxygen as I move further out into the world. Alright, there's that big, there's this big, like, mountain structure way out in the distance. So I'm gonna walk out there, and usually, like, around... You can see these big structures, usually there might be stuff around them. So that's the main reason I w why I wanted to come over here. But, uh, yeah, I don't really see anything around here. It's just a big structure. Oh! See, like I told you, there's a cave system. So, down in the caves you can find more materials, like, you can find, like, iron and copper, and those can all, th and they're all building materials, so those can all be used for building. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to bring tethers around the side like this, and then leading into the cave so that I'll have oxygen ready here, and also I, it'll help as a marker to mark where the cave is. And the, the, cave, the cave systems in these games go very, very deep from my experience. So, usually I have to use like an entire like tethered bundle just to reach the bottom. Which is what I'm using here, because I used up my first tether bundle to get here, and then I, s I set my first one down at the entrance, and then I've just been using one singular tether bundle, and I n no longer have uh, tethers. But uh, you see, now there's a drop here, and if I fall down there, I can't get back up. However, there is a way, uh, if you hold Alt, you can build up, but for some reason I can't do that, because they, they add a new thing. Uh, before you could just do it, like, whenever you wanted to, and you could also flatten terrain and stuff. But what they added was, so you guys may have seen uh, canisters. I can craft canisters, and then what that does is a canister, obviously it holds things, you know? So what I can do here is, if I, I want to place it on the side things, like that. So on the canister, if I dig the ground, you can see I, it sucks up into my gun, and then it should be pla and then it should be placed inside the canister. Yeah, soil. So if I just keep if I just keep digging the ground, the soil should fill up the canister, which you can see it's doing right now. It's like it's like gray material. And if I keep doing this, I should be able to fill up the canister. So that then I have a full canister of soil, and then I can use the soil to flatten and build terrain. But now that I have a full canister, I should be able to hold control. Oh yeah, now I can flatten stuff. But that uses up soil. And then if I hold alt, I can now build terrain. But anyways guys, that's just, that's gonna be it for this episode. I just wanted to give you guys a quick intro to the game. I'm sure you guys have already heard of the game, you already know what it's about. But I just wanted to show you all the new things. They were definitely new to me. I, I never watched any of the updates. Or like, read them in the Steam news or anything, but I really, I really think it's cool what they're doing, the way they're changing things with like the exo hab and the building and stuff. I, re I really like it. It's really cool. But uh, yeah, I want to know if if you guys think it's cool. Cause if you guys, if you guys like this video, uh, I'll definitely make more. And just you know, like, subscribe, comment down below, tell me what you want to see, want to see more of this game, that sort of thing. And uh, I'll see you on the next video. Bye.